What's up, Cloud Clan? I'm Cloud, and welcome to episode 17 of our Pokemon Heart Gold Randomizer Clan Lock. In the last episode, we took on Chuck and picked up our sixth, our fifth badge, not our sixth badge, our fifth badge. And uh, let's let's go over our team really quick. We've only got four. Uh, we had two losses recently. So leading off, we have Katie, who's level 31. There's Dizzy Punch, Fake Out, Dr Crunch, and Drain Punch. Uh, Sarsic is level 30 and has Flamethrower, Curse, Rapid Spin, and Smokescreen. Snow is level 31, holding the Quick Claw, which has Surf, Mudshot, Rock Tomb, and Growl. And then Frozen is level 31 with Razor Leaf, Fan Attack, Nasty Plot, and Whirlwind. So we now have... No, Huey. Not answering your phone call. I'm not answering your phone call. We have access to the Safari Zone over here. Oh, oh, hold up, hold up. That's better. And I'm actually going to lead off with Sarsic because she is the lowest level. And we did get an encounter over here, not in the Safari Zone quite yet. But uh, we got an encounter of a Wobbuffet. And I just passed on it because I don't see myself using it in uh, an LP like this. We, we encountered it right in here. If you see a fork in the road inside a cave, most likely one is right and the other one leads to a dead end. We're gonna... Oh. We're gonna run into a Carnivine. Huh. Okay. Let's go ahead and just go down this ladder, see where it takes us. We're on Route 47. I don't know if we have an encounter for this route. I don't think we do. Is Route 47 the same one as out here? If I can get outside, it is. We have not had an encounter in Route 47 yet. So let's go get one. Let's, let's get one. Let's go surf. So we can catch. Or attempt to catch anyway. Please be something we can use, something useful, not a... That's dupes, that's dupes, that's dupes, okay. Okay, dupes again. Come on, give me something good. Give me something good. A Rampardos. Alright. Has Mold Breaker. We're not staying in on you, though, and there's no way. Um, see, we don't have much to uh, actually try and catch something. That did a lot of damage. Um, let's see. Here, let's switch into Snow. And then switch back into Katie and get another Fake Out off. Okay. Now let's see if we can catch this. Can we catch you? Okay. It does not want to be caught. Scary face. Okay, yes. Scary, scary. It's so scary. Hey, we caught the Rimpardos. Its skull withstands impacts of any magnitude. As a result, its brain never gets the chance to grow. So, uh, we're gonna name this thing. I had a, a comment in the last episode from a guy named Noah, and he said uh, he didn't want it necessarily named after him. So, he gave me a male female uh, to nickname after. So, we're gonna name this Rampardos Mr. T. So, thank you, Noah, for leaving your comment, and your support's greatly appreciated. Let's check out our Mr. T. Oh, he's pure rock type. Focus energy, pursuit, takedown, and scary face with mold breaker. Has a special attack increasing nature and lowering the. That's not. Uh, his attack stats ridiculous though. Oh my goodness. He's level 19. We have level 30s, and his is still higher. But uh, we're gonna put him in the PC for now. See what we could have else. What else we could have uh, got? Just just to check. A Cleffa? That would have been dupes as well. Another Rampardos. Okay. 
Uh, let me see what we could have got if we used the rod. Okay, we still have it. We have still have it registered. Let's see. I'll just get like two different ones. I want to see when we fish. A masquerade. Okay. Head intimidate. Wow. All right. Another masquerade. Stop. Oh, we could have caught Ace of Viper. All right. You gotta stop. <sighs> Bye. All right, so let's go ahead and just go box this Rampardos. <clears throat> we have a lot of rock... Oh, nope. We have a lot of rock types sitting in the PC right now. <laughs> it's kind of unfortunate at the... We're not getting any different typings, really. Like, we don't have electric. Uh, we don't have dragon. We don't have ice. Uh, we don't have poison. Anyway. Let's go ahead and heal up. Box this Rampardos for now. Might use it at some point. Go ahead and move you in here. See, look at all these. We have this one is rock. This one is rock. Rock. And rock. <laughs> we don't have psychic typing either. That would be really nice, actually. Or, yeah, yeah, we already have dark. We already have dark. But yeah, psychic would be a nice typing to get. So let's go back. We still have our encounter in the Safari Zone, I believe. And let's just run around up here. Um, let's go up the ladder this time. It should bring us out where that double battle. Yep, this should be a double. Yep. One plus one is two, but the two of us together is much stronger. The two of us aren't just a, just some boring pair. Okay. Dust Dogs and Dodrio. Level 25. Okay. Let's go ahead and fake out the Dodrio and flamethrower the Dust Dogs. There we go. Oh, Dust Dogs goes for the Protect. So, uh, basically nothing but the fake out is going to go off. And I'm going to Drain Punch. No, it's not super effective. Uh, it should still kill though. Maybe. Let's Dizzy Punch it. Dizzy Punch will kill for sure. It tries to go for the double protect, but it doesn't work. The Strain Punch, or Dizzy Punch. Dizzy Punch should kill the Todrio, seeing how much damage Fake Out did. And then, I feel like this Dust Ox is dead. Yep, down goes the Dust Ox. And Sarsic is going to grow to level 31. Now everyone is level 31. So let's see who has the lowest HP. Snow does, actually. Wow. I mean, these are all either they don't have evolutions or they're at their final stage. Snow still has another stage, so that that is understandable. Let's carry on. You can actually surf around there. Well, I don't want to get this item, which is a lagging tail. And this looks like we have another double battle right here. Watching over my girlfriend makes my heart sore. My heart's feelings for my boyfriend are... Okay, stop with that. Okay, so this is not necessarily good for us. We got a Torterra out here. So... We're going to switch into... Uh, Frozen because Torterra is part ground also. And I'm going to go for the fake out on the Torterra. That's a okay, that's a critical hit. Okay, so that's a lot of damage. Even though we are uh, like 9 levels higher. I guess we can go for the faint attack on the Arbok and Dre or Dizzy Punch the Torterra. Let's see how much this does. Uh, there was a critical hit with the fake out. It doesn't quite kill. And the faint attack is going to do... Oh, that's a good amount of damage. and uh, It goes for the Acid. Oh, right. Okay, we're alright. We eat it up. As Torterra goes for the Razor Leaf, 
Which shouldn't do too much. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. Okay, okay, okay. All these critical hits happening. And we're just gonna go that on the Arbok, and I'm going to... I'm just gonna crunch the Torterra. Because that'll kill. Down goes Torterra. And uh, down goes the Arbok. And KD is going to grow to level 32. Cool. So, Route 48. This is a new area. Please. Give me something good. Okay, that's dupes, because we have a Graveler. These rock types need to stop. Seriously. Ooh! A vile Plume. Now, we already have a Grass type, but that's Grass and Poison. Uh, I really like that typing. And... I don't know. Let's go to Katie. I don't feel like Fake Out is a good idea. Drain Punch is resisted, I'm pretty sure. Is Drain Punch resisted? Ah! Uh, I, I don't know. I don't feel comfortable. I don't feel comfortable going for any of that. It goes for the Aromatherapy. I'm going to go for the Rage Relief because that is... Okay, wow. You ate that. So I think you should be fine with the... Fake out. Okay, yep, you're good. And uh, now let's go for... Let's switch out, out into Sarsic. And uh, Rapid Spin. A few times. Okay, you're getting it. Okay, Sun Spore. One more. Hey. Okay. Okay. Let's go ahead and throw a Great Ball at you. Can we catch? No. File Plume says no. Guess for the Giga Drain or the Mega Drain. Is this, yeah, Mega Drain. Okay, Vile Plume staying this ball. Hey, Vile Plume stayed in the ball. It has the world's largest petals. With every step, the petals shake out heavy clouds of toxic pollen. All right, so uh, there's only one other person that we haven't nicknamed it after that left a comment on the last episode and remember if you do want a pokemon named after you to leave comments on uh try and leave comments as often as you can that'll uh, really increase your chances because i always look at the last episode beforehand so whimsical uh thank you for leaving your comment and uh todd is calling us oh yeah we're poisoned but poison doesn't kill in this game i'm pretty sure found a nugget we can go sell that Okay, even though I don't think it kills, it's still making me uncomfortable. We have five antidotes anyway. But we need to go back to the Pokemon Center. And uh, I do not believe I'm adding this Vile Plume to the party because we do have a Grass type already. So Relax Nature, which is increases speed and lowers defense. Has Chlorophyll, Mega Drain, Aromatherapy, Stun Sport, and Poison Powder. It's not a bad moveset. But uh, as I said, we already have a Grass type, and adding another Grass type would not be very good. We got a Goldeen here, but we have uh, Snow already, so not going that route. We could add a Roserade? Are you kidding me? I'm wondering if there's... Okay, is there a Pokemon Center up here? Thank goodness. I did not want to have to run all the way back to Seenwood and then all the way back over here. Go ahead and box this file plume. We've got one of the typings we didn't have with poison, but it was also on a grass type, so. Alright. Let's go ahead. I'm just gonna chat around and see what we got here. Not to Butterfree though. We wanna buy something. Uh what do you what do you have to sell? What do you have to sell? Okay, that's cool. Safari Zone, it makes me feel like I'm in a foreign country. It brings up a strange feeling. I decided to carry Pokemon drinks. What do you got? Ah, uh, you got the expensive stuff. You've got the expensive stuff. There are many Pokemon to choose from, but nothing beats the cuteness of Slowpoke. People often say that I look like one. I don't know if that's a compliment or not. 
Safari Safari, it is so much fun. Safari Safari is so interesting, huh? So many Pokemon are waiting for us. That's a song I made up. I sing it when I'm in the Safari Zone. Come back! I always have wanted to catch my first Pokemon at the Safari Zone. Then go see if you could catch one. Are you too young? You're not 10 yet. I'm not a talker. Oh, okay. All right. Oh. <clears throat> Boy, I have been waiting for you. What do you think? This is a brand new Safari Zone, by the way. I just had an idea. Would you like to take the owner aptitude test? Sure. Right on. Let me explain how the test works. It's very easy. All you have to do is catch one Geodude at the Safari and show it to me. I want to catch a Geodude. They're in the grass closer to the entrance. It shouldn't take long before you catch one. Good luck. I want to catch a Geodude. Uh, sure. Can we just go in right away? What's this way? Okay, cannot be used yet. I guess we go in right here. Welcome to the Safari Zone for this 500. You can play a Safari game. Would you like to play? Yes. That'll be 500. And here we go. Can we get something good in here? Let's see. Let's see. What area should we go into? Uh, Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Not feeling it yet. Not feeling it yet. Can we encounter something right here? Or oh, yep, I'm feeling this one. I'm feeling this one. I don't count for the safari zone. Is it Paris? <sighs> Not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. I'm sorry. We could have caught a Jigglypuff. It's a little better, I guess. All right, what else could we have caught? What other? Let's just check out the other areas really quick. <sighs> Could have had a Larvitar. Oh, I would have loved to catch this. I would have loved to catch this. We don't have either of those typings with uh, within our party right now, but we have a steel or not a steelix, a an agron. The thing is, shift tree has so many weaknesses. So many. We could have had a bell sprout. Pidgey. Ah, I would have caught that right away. Alright, about to get- Oh, uh, we could have had a Mr. Mime, too? Alright, what's in here? Cough! Oh, that would have been perfect. And a wheezing? Uh, and there's uh, several in here. There's a, such a high chance of getting- And there's Ekans in here, too. That's kind of funny. Oh my goodness, I should have went into this one first. Ah, oh, dang it. And then let's just check this one really quick. There's the Geodude. Do we have to catch a Geodude for something? Like, um, let's see if we can catch it. Um, this is not going towards, we're not going to be using this at all. I just want to see if, uh, see about getting that thing that guy was talking about. Okay, we caught the Geodude. We're not going to nickname you. Okay, let's go talk to him. Oh, no, I wanted to, I wanted to leave. Okay, so now let's talk about the Geodude. You passed the first test. Did I tell you that there are two tests? That's right. Becoming an owner is not easy. The second test, well, I'm still preparing for it. Well, you know what this... Okay. So is this a... Oh, okay. Let's go to the PC and release this Geodude. We don't need it anymore. Where'd it go? Did he, did he take... Oh, it's in our party. That's right. It's in our fight. Okay. Let's release this Geodude. It has an Everstone on it. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna take it, um, just because, uh, it wasn't intended to be used anyway. Alright, so, Booty Encounter again, of course. I don't know... Ah! Uh, ah! Uh. No item back here? Or did we already pick it? I don't remember. I don't remember. There's some good Pokemon in this grass, though. Just good Pokemon in general. 
Let's go this way. Okay, we already... Uh, we haven't been down there. Go down the ladder. And cross this bridge. Hello! I'm not good with large crowds, so I, I'm camping out here with my Pokemon. Are you the same way? Uh, not necessarily. Got a Glam Meow. I'm just going to surf. And Snow's going to go to level 32. And then a Venomoth is going to come out. Uh, we can go into Sarsic for this. And get a Flamethrower off as it goes for the Poison Powder. But we are okay. A Revive, that's pointless. We'll sell that, though. And yes, we are poisoned. Uh, we are poisoned. I know. We're all right. We're all right. I'd like to go down that slope thing and see if we can encounter something in that water. But uh, we can't do that right now. So I believe what is left is we just need to surf back up and uh, get ready for Jasmine. Do we have some repels? We have one and one stupid repel. So I'm pretty sure this pharmacy now sells. Uh, yes, it now sells some some different potions. Um, we go buy five of these. You don't sell any repels though. But uh, let's go ahead and sell our nugget. Get five thousand for that. Nice. And uh, our revive. Okay. Now we can go ahead and uh, make our way to Jasmine. Alright, let's go. Let's go ahead and throw on the regular repel. And then we'll just use the other repel after that runs out. There it goes. Bye-bye. And now the super repel. Okay. Now we're back. I guess we could have just used this, just the super repel. And we would have been okay. Uh, nope. We don't need to heal. We didn't run into anything. So. Looking at around 22 minutes. I think we might have a little bit of time to take her on. I knew you'd come here. Thank you for helping with the gym leader, but uh, but battle is a separate matter. Go for it. Okay. Giggle. I know you're capable. I know you're capable. You are from the lighthouse. It's time you showed the side of yourself to Jasmine. Good luck. Oh. Oh, we just battled Jasmine straight on. Okay. Are we are we okay on potions? Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't remember her levels, but let's go for it. Thank you for your help at the lighthouse, but this is different. Please allow me to introduce myself. I am Jasmine, a gym leader. I use the Clang. Steel type. Do you know about the steel type? They're very hard, cold, sharp, and really strong. Um, I'm not lying. All right, Jasmine. Joe. <laughs> All right, Cop Joe leads off. With a Metang, it's actual. Okay, she actually has a Steel type. That's okay though. We can go for the Mud Shot. See how much damage this will do. It should do a decent amount. Almost half. It goes for the Scary Face. Ooh. Where's our speed? I'm gonna go for the Surf. As it goes for the Confusion. Okay. We take that pretty well. Hopefully this won't do enough damage so that she... Okay, okay. It takes out with a critical hit! I wanted to try and do a little bit less damage, but uh, Surf, is, Surf is stronger, so... Okay, Spinda is going to come out. We can go into Katie here. Go for the Fake Out. And then go for the Drain Punch. <laughs> I don't know if you... I know, I'm sure some of you know this, but... Uh, I don't think any of the Spinda's designs are exactly the same. Because the dots and stuff move around on it. They're, I can't remember. There's a really ridiculously high number of how many Spinda designs there are. And I remember when I first was playing... Uh, Prinplup. When I was first playing... Um, oh, shoot. Was it... 
Ruby? I think it was Ruby. And, um, I remember I just keep running into Spindas and catching them because I liked all their different designs. And uh, I wanted so badly to catch a shiny one. Her ace is level 35, but that is around half. You're not steel type yet. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry about that. We do take the print plup down with another razor leaf. As frozen grows to level 32. We'll be, be, be defeated, cop Joe. Well done. Yeah, 4,200 for winning. That's nice. You are a better trainer than me in both skill and kindness. In accordance to the... In, in, blah, 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 blah. Try again. In, in accordance with league rules, I confer upon you this badge. Okay, we have the mineral badge from Jasmine, which means we get another token, which we have not had to use any so far. With that badge, all Pokemon, including traded Pokemon up to level 70, will obey you without question. Uh, please take this too. I'm going to get TM23, which is... It's called Iron Tail. Your Pokemon will hit the target with its hard tail, occasionally lowering the target's defense. Alright, so we got an Iron Tail. Let's see if anyone in our party can learn it. Probably not. Oh! Sarsic can learn it? Wow. Now we'll hold on to it for now, though. And that is our sixth gym badge. Huey! No! I don't want to talk to you, Huey. I don't want to take- thank you. Second time Huey's called in this episode. He needs to chill. He needs to find some more friends. That's what he needs to do. I'm not- I don't even claim to be his friend. I'm just an acquaintance that kindly gave him my number. But uh, anyway, we will continue on in the next episode. And if you guys did enjoy today's episode of our Pokemon Heart Gold Randomizer Clan Lock, please remember to leave a like, comment, maybe even subscribe if you haven't already to become part of the Cloud Clan. That'd be greatly appreciated. And I will see you next time.